this video, we will learn how to create a beautiful website using HTML, CSS. First of all, in the body section, I will create here a div with the class name as main. This will be our main div. And after that, first of all, we need to create our navigation bar. For creating the navigation bar, I will take here a div with the class name as header. And inside that, I will be using the list items for creating the navigation links. After the headache section, I will be taking here a div with the class name as body section. Now it's time to style our HTML document. First of all, we need to link our style.css file in our HTML document. First of all, I need here a background image in the body section. So I will be using here the background image property. I will be using the linear gradient, two colors with RGB colors. Black color will be there with the 0.75 opacity top to bottom. Here I will be using the URL. Inside the URL, I will put the link of the image. For images, I will be using the website that is Pixabay. Pixabay is the website that provides you the loyalty free images. Here I will also provide the width 98% and height will be 98 view height. After that I will start the header section. Here I will be using the display flex property. So I would be able to use all the properties of the flex. Justify content, here is the property of flex. If you are not using the display flex, you won't be able to use this property. Now let's start styling our list item inside header. Here display property inline block will make all the list items in one line. Now we will also style our button.
Now we also need to specify a placeholder inside the input field. Now we will also make some hover effects on the list items. Now we need to style the body section. Before styling it, I need to have a heading 1 and a paragraph. After the paragraph, I need to have two buttons as well. I will be taking these two buttons inside this pen tag because I want these two buttons in one line. In the body section, I will use the property display as flex. Here I will use the flex direction property and keep the value as column because I don't want all the items inside the body section to be in one row. I want all them in three different columns. Now we will do some further stylings for the body section. Now as the button has been already styled, but I will design the specifically buttons inside the body section. I will just I have just copied all the button properties and paste inside this body section button. Now we will assign a class to the contact button so I could style it differently and I will style the contact button differently. So here is the stylings. I will just change the background color from blue violet to white and the color of the text from white to the blue violet. This is how we can create a website using HTML and CSS. If you have any query, you can put it in the comment section. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.